about to give a state of the state and my colleagues here in the legislature that 2020 must finally be the year that we take on the PBMs. Enough is enough. No more closing our independent pharmacies. No more hosing our taxpayers. No more taking advantage of our patients. And because of you all and some of our some of our uh, supporters and allies in the legislature, we're going to get it done this year. <laughs> We, we ended the year, as you all know, with some bad news and that veto that came down. But the good news is, we started 2019 where I think maybe none of my colleagues knew what a PBM even was. Right? They all know what a PBM is right now. Yeah! We, had, yeah. 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 we started 2019 with really no legislative traction take on this issue and hold them accountable. We ended, that's right, we ended 2019 with cutting out spread pricing for Medicaid, right? An investigative report that highlighted all of the injustices that happened in this industry. And we start 2020 now with, I think, a focus on finishing what we did last year. And with all of you, we're gonna do that. Let's give them hell, let's have a good 2020. Yeah. 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 Yeah.